Hi everybody, I'm Brad. Welcome to the channel. Uh, in, in this one, I am going way, way, way outside my comfort zone. I saw Carol from Carol Arts Room do a uh, beach swipe. Uh, she used all the Bloom products and did a beach swipe and, and it really gave me an idea to try to do a sunset beach swipe. Um, so I thought I'd give it a try. I have never tried one of those before. I'm not that good at swipes. And in this one, I'm not using any tube or bottle paints. Everything is gonna be pigments. So this is either gonna turn out really, really good or this is gonna be a complete failure. Uh, but we're gonna give it a go anyway. So uh, I hope you liked the video. If you do, please hit like and subscribe. Let's go over the colors. First color is gonna be Black Diamond Purple Haze, which is a beautiful purple. Then Black Diamond Scarlet. And these colors will be part of this, these will be the sunset. Black Diamond Pink Pearl. Then for the transition, we're going to use TLP Sequins, which is a really cool interference color. It has a, a violet color to it. Um, I hope that shows up. A lot of times if you wipe that off, you can really see the, the colors in it. Then as we fade back into the ocean, we're going to use TLP Glisten which is another beautiful interference color. I just got these in and haven't done anything with them. So I thought this would be a good time to break these out. This one is absolutely incredible. Uh, look at the greens and the blues in that. That is just amazing. Then Black Diamond Pigments, Deep Blue Sea. Black Diamond Pigments Caribbean Blue. Black Diamond Pigments Bora Bora Blue. I've used this in a couple. This is just a beautiful color. I love this one. Then for the transition and for the waves, I thought a little Black Diamond Pigments Pearl White. And we may drizzle a little of that up in the sky to give it the effect of maybe some clouds. I don't know, I'll see as I'm doing it. And then for the beach, we're gonna use Black Diamond Pig Pigments Liberty Copper. So those are the colors today. Uh, like I said, I have no idea how this is gonna pan out, but we're gonna give it a go. I'll be using two different cell activators, Amsterdam Titanium White and Amsterdam Lamp Black. I appreciate it. Let me get all this cleaned up. Let me get the uh, canvas ready and then I'll bring you back in and we'll put some paint down and see what happens. Okay, I've already flooded the canvas, did the edges. Uh, we've all seen that a thousand times so I didn't think you'd want to see that. I think I'm going to start off with the bottom part with the, the beach and the sand. So we'll put down our Liberty Copper first. I am a little nervous. I've never done one like this and I have no idea. So I hope it turns out. I'm not gonna go all the way to the edges because when I spin it, some of that's gonna come off anyway. So, lots of air bubbles in this for some reason. I mixed this about four hours ago. Thought these would dissipate by now, but they have not. So, just bear with me and we will get through this. All right.
Now a little bit of the pearl white for the transition. beach colors and these I'm doing three for the water so I'm going to try to transition them I hope this turns out because if not this is a lot of pigment paints to waste. That was the Bora Bora Blue. Next up is the Caribbean Blue. And those will kind of overlap a little bit. And we'll have a little spot in the middle where it's a little bit heavier. And then our Bora Bora Blue, or I'm sorry, uh, Deep Sea Blue is next. And again, we're going to put a little dab here and there, try to make it look as close to water as I can. And then some of our transition with our TLP interference colors. That one was Glisten. And this one is Sequins. our sunset. Now it was Black Diamond Scarlet. I'm sorry, uh, Pink Pearl. This is Black Diamond Scarlet. And then Black Diamond Purple Haze. So, what I think I'm going to do is do black down on the beach and then I'll do white on the rest of it. What do you think? Got that about the right width. All right, let's give it a try and see what happens. Like I said, I am not that good at swipes, but maybe we can save it. a little bit here and there but let me see what I can do to recover Let's see if we can't save that
Yep, so far, I might be able to live with that. Oh, let's see. Yep, that's going to be just about right. Now let's try this part. And I'm just using a plastic hardware store putty knife for a swiping tool. Uh, but you can use anything, whatever, whatever works for you. Try to tip a little of this off over here. And then we'll do a little spin and we'll see what happens. Okay. Bring that paint back towards the center. Let's see what happens. Not exactly what I had in mind, but uh, I wouldn't call it terrible. I do like the way those interference colors are working at the top. Um, Yeah, not exactly what I wanted. I think I did a little too much white here and maybe a little too much up in there, but uh, not bad for the first one. What do you think? I don't know if you can see those interference colors at the top or not. Let's see if I can get it around this way and get it to shift for you. Thank you for joining in. Uh, 
Please hit the like and subscribe if you enjoyed this and tell your friends and we'll catch you on the next one.